the streaming ecosystem with Valorant because that's <laughs> all right. Let's do it. Okay, I'm last. Extremely uh, talked about, especially amongst the streamers. Uh, so how it works um, in order to kind of give you know riot a boost on twitch they have the system where to get into the beta you have to get it through watching streams and obviously this boosts the number of every streamer who have drops enabled now riot first did this with legends of runeterra but the difference there i mean okay i took advantage of the drop system but I, think that I abused that shit i was running did you VODs. replay vods oh yeah i replay vods and uh, i will come up with titles that are technically true but made it look like uh you know the place to get it was my channel even though it was the same so for legend of runeterra if you stream legends of runeterra and you you can your viewers get a chance to get drops doesn't matter who you are one viewer 10 viewer 10,000 viewer 100,000 also viewers. just to add for anyone that may not really understand a drop is basically access to the closed beta game closed beta means like only certain people can access the game and in order to get that access, you have to get a drop via watching someone on Twitch. Yeah, so you just have to watch someone and um, eventually, if you're lucky, it'll drop. And people came up with all these theories like, okay, what if I watch 1,000 streams at the <laughs> same time? What if I watch a streamer with only one viewer because I'm the only viewer, I'll get the drop. It's like mm -hmm. this, the way the system works is basically Twitch takes everyone who's watching the stream and everyone has like an equal chance. You just need mm -hmm. one stream open. Stop killing your PC and your internet with a thousand mm -hmm. streams open. But people still have these beliefs, which is why like right now, every single Valorant streamer with drops enabled is getting like double, triple, 10 times that you're using. Yeah, Google, Google, Google. even more. Even more. Like 10 or 20 times, it's crazy. <laughs> Holy uh, fucking shit, dude, that's crazy. The difference with Valorant though, is that Riot is has a list Sorry. of streamers that had drops enabled. A very exclusive short list. And if you're not on this list, you don't have drops enabled. And if you don't have drops enabled, no one's going to watch you because you'll be at like page seven <laughs> of the Twitch uh, directory for Valorant. Now, I don't have a horse in this race because you know I'm on Facebook. We don't have drops uh, for Valorant. But as an outsider looking at this, I'm like, wow, this is this is next level. Uh, uh it's it's like how would, like I don't know, man. It's it really messes up the streaming ecosystem with that. I, I th completely. Oh, sorry. Go ahead, Fed. No, I was gonna say. I almost think like it's unintentional. Sorry, my my piece. It's almost unintentional on their part. What, what do you? Wait, what, what, what do you think, uh... Scott? Keep going, keep going. No, like keep, I want to be the last horse in the, in the race. Like, you talked last time, yeah. I got the hot take this time. Let's go. Yeah, I mean, for me personally, it hasn't really affected me. Everyone's streaming Valorant, so I'm like, all right, I'm going to take over just chatting bitches. But, like, <laughs> I, can see, I, I can see why, like, someone like, I don't know, Scar or Lily, who, who have been very integrated into the Riot ecosystem for how many years? Like, their whole fucking careers. And it, it just it looks kind of bad in my eyes. Um, but, I mean... It just, yeah, it doesn't really affect me. So I don't really have, I like toes a horse in the race. The viewership boost is absolutely insane. And it took me a couple days to really realize how there are so many streamers that don't have it. And also consider if I was in their shoes, how much I would hate the current Twitch meta. There is always Twitch metas. Sometimes it's a certain game. Sometimes it's a certain streaming style. Sometimes it's just chatting. Um, but I would def definitely, I would probably just like take a break. Honestly, if I didn't have a drop right now, I would just say F it. Cause everybody's already mostly watching Valorant streams. Um, also I, as because of that, because of how inherently unfair the situation kind of is, I've tried to make it a point to host people that don't have drops enabled because people <laughs> that do are getting free viewers either way. You know what I mean? Yeah. So gotta share some of the love. You, I would imagine your viewer would be not happy if you host someone without drops enabled. Dude, so many of them aren't even there. So in a sense, I'm giving free viewership <laughs> free, to someone free else. Bots. Five head, yeah. <laughs> yeah it's uh, if you're someone with drops enabled, you know, 
it's great for you and i would take advantage of this like if i had valorant drops enabled i would be running i would be one of those people Ooh. running replays yeah people okay i've seen a lot of people be, be uh very mad at people for running replays <laughs> for certain titles uh, i saw a lot of people use a title that's like uh highest uh highest percent drops here or something mm -hmm. and uh, uh, yeah. used it for half a stream and people were pissed you... and even though like on stream i was like oh like this is a joke so many people are using this as a joke title right but yeah i think right now the the meta is a hey, you have to have drops enabled and if you're one of those, what you have to do is come up with a title that makes it seem like your stream is the best place to get drops <laughs> while not outright lying, like clickbaiting. But then you have guys like uh, Dr. Disrespect, who doesn't have drops enabled, who just says drops, I drops, think drops. Oh, he doesn't have it he, enabled? Yeah, no. Yeah. That's he, the big... He, he, his he, title just says drops, drops, drops for no reason? Yeah. yeah drops maximize. Yep. I'm a dumb drops. viewer. <laughs> I didn't even realize. I watched his stream today and I was like, oh, I did Like, I knew he didn't have it enabled before, but I thought he had gotten it because no, of no, the no, title. No, like, a lot of people complained wow. about it. And, like, he didn't... He stopped playing the game for, like, a couple of days. And now he's back on it. And he recently, like... Like sort of like was gonna do apology but then he like ended the apology with like i don't give a fuck i'm just like I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. that was his fucking twitter apology it was yeah. like oh i mean God. he can get away with it because he can just chalk it up to his persona mm -hmm. and twitch twitch is not gonna take action against one of their biggest money maker oh and... no i don't think twitch would take action against anyone for like clickbaiting title like that yeah no, i, don't think so I mean i think like saying highest percentage drops or stuff like that is fine but like saying drops when you don't have drops like it starts towing like it starts crossing the line in my opinion because like you can't tell on mobile whether or not a stream has drops enabled i believe mm -hmm. only on PC. oh yeah you can't i agree it's misleading and as a viewer i would be bothered because i actually just fell for it this morning <laughs> not that i was like waiting for drops but i just like checked his stream Assuming and i was like he oh he drops. got it enabled yeah, yeah. um but yeah, I also I still don't think Twitch would take action against something like that. Yeah. But as a viewer, I'd be like, oh, that's annoying. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then um, I'm surprised like he, he didn't get drops because I'm sure Riot so, like, offered. Right? He, he he wanted to stream it, the play test, and he because he they said no, he didn't go. He got really? offered. That's apparently the story. I'm not sure I, how. I, I thought Very he like, well? forgot or something. No, no, no. They wouldn't forget him. He got the invite. Okay. No, no, no. I thought like he forgot to show up on the day of uh, or something. Yeah, maybe. No, I was told that he wanted to stream it, like the actual play testing, and they said mm -hmm. no, which completely reasonable. You yeah, because we had a day to stream it.